So today we got the top five NFL wide receivers, and I got my stat book here to prove it. At number five, we have Devonte Parker, and I know he's on a really bad team, but this this one man did a whole bunch of stuff for that team last season. And I'm expecting him to do even better this season with a new quarterback if Tua gets to start. So Devontae Parker had 72 receptions, 1,202 yards with Ryan Fitzpatrick. With Ryan Fitzpatrick, he did all of that. He had almost 17 yards of catch. He had 56 drops, though. But then, so that's Devontae Parker. Number four, we have Keenan Allen. I didn't know what to do between Devontae Parker and Keenan Allen, so I put Keenan Allen at number four for one reason and one reason only. He has less yards, more catches, but he has 45 drops. Compared to Devontae Parker's 56 drops, that's the only reason why Keenan Allen is at number four. He has 1,199 yards. And then up next we have Chris Godwin from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I think it's the NFL is confusing since everything is changing. <laughs> Anyways, Chris Godwin had 86 receptions, 1,333 yards with Jameis Winston. That man, Jameis Winston, he went to the Saints. I don't know what Sean Payton sees in him. Probably nothing that anybody else could. Or maybe they're just do something else. Anyways, he had 86 receptions for 1,333 yards, 16th in the NFL for receptions. He had nine touchdowns. James Winston, he threw 30 interceptions. Um, let's just not mention that, and if we don't mention it, it's probably just going to disappear. So, just don't mention it to Sean Payton, because maybe he just forgot about that part, or, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> number two, Michael Thomas. Now, please do not rage and X out of the video, because I put Michael Thomas at number two. Who? Okay, so he had the most yards in the NFL. He had the most catches. 149 receptions. 1,725 yards. That's a lot of yards. But what other wide receivers can you safely say the Saints had that season? I know now they have Emmanuel Sanders. They have a tight end. But wide receivers, not tight end, wide receivers. I'm listening. I didn't hear anything. Exactly, they had none besides Michael Thomas. And that number one, it's not DeAndre Hopkins. He's not on this list at all. It's Julio Jones. Julio Jones is incredible. Did you see that Super Bowl play that he had? He had multiple plays in that Super Bowl. Did you see the one where he was on the sideline and then he went, Boy, what a catch. Well, anyways, that was my favorite, one of my favorite plays from him. But... He had 99 catches. So much less than Michael Thomas. That's four, that is 50 less catches than Michael Thomas, if my math is correct. And it is 50 less catches than Michael Thomas. And, had, and he had 400 less yards than Michael Thomas. So if Michael Thomas had, many, had as many catches as... No, Julio Jones had as many catches as Michael Thomas did... Just imagine what he would have done if he had those many, that many receptions. Probably would have gone up in touchdowns, up in yards by a lot. He had 1,394 yards off of 99 catches. Those are the top five wide receivers in the NFL today. If you guys disagree or you guys have anybody that you think should be in the top five, go put it down in the comments. I'm going to try and make it so you guys can do comments. And then some more NFL news. There's no preseason. It was canceled last night. 
It's what the NFL players wanted for safety reasons, but then some NFL coaches and managers, well, well, we want the NFL preseason because we have to figure out our roster. We don't know how those people are going to play since all this stuff has been happening. We didn't have spring training or any of it. But the NFL players, for safety reasons, canceled the preseason. And then he, now here's more AB news. Antonio Brown. He retired from the NFL, yet he wasn't on a team. So I guess he's retiring from unemployment from the NFL, if that makes any sense. And then Michael Bennett, a Seahawks defensive tackle, is retired after many Many, 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 many years. Now that's a lot of many's. If you can count that many's, does that even make sense? Probably not. But if there's any more NFL stuff that you guys want me to do, put it down in the comments and I will do it. Since I already have a top five running back video that I'm gonna put up eventually. And if more NFL news comes out, I'll do that. And I'll make a whole playlist. Since why not, you know? So if you guys have any other top five orders, just put them in the comments. I will look at it. Put their stats down too, so that way I know why you think they're there. Also, DeAndre Hopkins, there's only one reason why he's in there. He was 16th in the NFL in being a wide receiver, so. That's all. Okay. Like, subscribe, share, all that fun stuff. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.